Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's been about a month since I did my last Lush haul, which is a very long time. So I'm happy to share with you guys this haul. It seems like they changed the sticker. This little patching sticker it used to be green and now it's black and it says thank you and handle with care, which is nice because um, they did deliver this package in great condition. So I'm happy because the last two packages just weren't in great condition. Um, anyway, this one was packed by Noah, so thank you, Noah. So let's see what's inside this box. This order was placed on July 11th, and I only ordered four products, and they're all kitchen items. Um, this is how much I spent. That's quite a bit. And let's see what I pull out first. And it is the Yummy 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 Shower Gel. This says, lather yourself in summer sun with fresh strawberry infusion and passion flower oil. Pick your own and keep the whole punnet to yourself. This has fresh strawberries infusion, honey water, fine sea salt, olibanum oil, bergamot oil, geranium oil, almond oil, passion flower oil, and balsamic vinegar. This has a peachy color to it, and it's filled up to here. It's not filled all the way to the top. This shares its scent with Yummy Mummy, but Yummy Mummy has a deeper, richer scent. This one smells more light and sweet and maybe just a tiny bit citrusy. The shower gel was made by Sophie, so thank you, Sophie. Let's see what's in this corner. This is Furs Body Lotion. This says, when times feel dark, fill the warmth of the sun with uplifting and bright neroli oil. And on the front, it says, gorse blooms year-round, speckling hedgerows and country paths with bright, cheerful yellow flowers. This has almond oil, fair trade organic cocoa butter, mimosa absolute, and neroli oil. The color of this is not white. There's a bit of tint to it. And just like the other lotions I bought from Lush, this is quite runny as well. This is supposed to share the same scent as salted coconut hand scrub, which I've never tried before. Um, I don't even know what it smells like. And I wonder if it also shares the same scent as the first bath mouth, which I do have, um, but I haven't used it yet because I keep forgetting because I have it in the fridge. And I'm too lazy to go check and see if it does have the same scent. But this has um, a definite almond smell to it, and that's pretty much all I can tell. It's very, very subtle. It's not strong at all. It's very, very, very light. My skin absorbed this lotion easily and quickly, and it definitely did not leave a greasy feeling. Thank you, Sophie, for making this lotion, because this is definitely a lotion I can use during the summer. Here is Yummy Mummy Body Conditioner, and it says, You're just the sweetest. Fresh strawberry juice and redolent tonka fill the sumptuous pot of fruity floral hydration. And on the front, it says, Brightening burst of orange oil from Brazil lie within, ready to tone skin and boost the mood. This has organic almond oil, fair trade organic cocoa butter, murumuru butter, fresh strawberry juice, Geranium oil, Brazilian orange oil, and Tonka Absolute. This shares the same scent family as Yummy Yummy Yummy. And just like the Yummy Mummy Shower Cream, this has the same deep um, scent to it. And it seems like the more I smell it, the more I can tell that there are strawberries in this. It's just nice and sweet and also has that hint of caramel in it as well. Yummy Mummy Body Conditioner was made by Sam, so thank you, Sam. And this one is a shower jelly. And this is American Pie Shower Jelly. And it says right here, you'll never want to say bye-bye, Miss American Pie, to these aromatic vanilla lathers. And on the front, it says, this fragrant strawberry shaker will steal your heart on the very first date. Prepare to fall in love. This has fresh strawberry infusion, carrageenan extract, vanilla absolute, 
Prairie Sage Oil and Lavender Oil. This has a creamy, milky, pale pink color. It kind of looks like strawberry mousse yogurt to me. People say this smells like strawberry milkshake, but I don't get that at all. I just smell the clary sage oil and lavender oil. I don't even smell the strawberries in this or the vanilla absolute. This thing does not want to come out. Ugh. So here it is. I finally got it out of its container. It's so cute. I really like the color. It's so girly. It's so squishy. It's so jiggly. And hey, look at that. Look at it go. I don't know how anyone can just use it. I just want to play with it all day. Oh my gosh. It's so fun. So you guys, you need to get one for yourself. Wee! Oh my goodness. Wee! Yes, look at it go. Wee! Around around in circles. American Pie Shower Jelly was made by Sam, so thank you, Sam. So, on to my favorite, the samples. I can't remember what I requested. I think I requested lip balm. Let's just see. Ooh, oh yes. I did request a sherbet shouter. Wait, lemon sherbet shouter. So that makes three. I think I have three so far. Rose Lollipop Lip Balm. Oh, I've never tried that one before, so that's pretty exciting. And this is Whipstick Lip Balm. That's exciting too. I haven't tried that. What is this one? None of your beeswax lip balm. I haven't tried that as well, so yay. And Lip Service Lip Balm, which I've tried. I just had the other sample and I enjoyed that. So those are my five samples. So here's how much they gave me. You might not think the lip balm samples are a lot, but believe me, they do last a long time. So here's one last look at my Lush haul from July 11th. If you'd like to see more Lush hauls, click that red subscribe button below. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Just to let you guys know, I received another Lush package today, and another one is on its way. So stay tuned for those unboxings. Until then, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye!